Mahindra Electric Mobility Limited, formerly known as the Reva Electric Car Company, is an Indian company based in Bangalore, involved in designing and manufacturing of compact electric vehicles. The company's first vehicle was the Revi Electric Car, available in 26 countries with more than 4,000 of its different versions sold worldwide by mid-March 2011. Reva was acquired by Indian conglomerate Mahindra and Mahindra in May 2010. After the acquisition, the company launched the electric hatchback E20 in 2013. Today, the company sells electric vehicles in different segments, the electric CitySmart hatchback E20+, the electric sedan Everito and electric commercial vehicle ESA Pro passenger and cargo. Topic history The Reva Electric Car Company RECC was founded in 1994 by Chetan Mainai, as a joint venture between the Mainai Group of Bangalore and American Electric Vehicle Technologies AEVT Inc. of the USA. The company's sole aim was to develop and produce an affordable compact electric car. Several other automakers were also aiming to do so, but in 2001 RECC launched the Reva. Reva was an acronym for Revolutionary Electric Vehicle Alternative. RECC joined up with several automotive experts to develop components for Reva. Curtis Instruments, Inc. of USA developed a motor controller specifically for the car. The car had a power pack for which Tudor India Limited supplied customized Prestolite batteries. The charger for Reva was developed by Modular Power Systems of USA, a division of TDI Power. Later, RECC started manufacturing the charger themselves through a technical collaboration agreement between MPS and the Mainai Group. In 2004, Going Green of the UK entered into an agreement with RECC to import Reva cars and market them under the GWIS moniker. In 2008, a revamped Reva model was launched called the Revi. The company started production of a lithium ion variant called the Reva L Ion in 2009. In 2009 at the Frankfurt Motor Show, Reva presented its future models Reva NXR and Reva NXG. During the event Reva and General Motors India declared a technical collaboration to develop affordable EV for the Indian market. As a result of this General Motors India announced an electric version of their hatchback in the New Delhi Auto Expo 2010, named the eSpark, Reva was to provide battery technology. On the 26th of May 2010, India's largest sports utility vehicles and tractor maker Mahindra and Mahindra bought a 55.2% controlling stake in Reva. Following the deal, the company was renamed Mahindra Reva Electric Vehicles Private Limited. Mahindra's president of automotive business, Pawan Goenka, became the new company's chairman. As a result of the ownership change, General Motors pulled out of the tie up with Reva that was to produce the eSpark. In February 2011, Going Green, the UK's exclusive importer of the G Wiz, announced that it was no longer stocking the model, although it would order them on a four to six week lead time when requested by customers. In 2016, the company was rebranded as Mahindra Electric Mobility Limited. With the intention to reflect not just the business line of producing vehicles, but also developing powertrains and integrated mobility solutions. Topic: <laughs> Reva and Revi. Mahindra Reva currently produces two versions of the Revi: an urban electric micro car seating two adults and two children. Revi, equipped with lead acid batteries, which has a nominal range of 80 km 50 miles per charge and a top speed of 80 km per hour 50 miles per hour. Reva L-Ion, equipped with lithium-ion batteries, which has higher acceleration and a nominal range of 120 km 75 miles per charge. The Reva went on sale in India in 2001 and in the UK since 2003. The different versions of the Reva have sold more than 4,000 vehicles worldwide by mid-March 2011 and is also available in the following countries, Bhutan, Brazil, Chile, Colombia, Costa Rica, Cyprus, France, Germany, Greece, Hungary, Iceland, Ireland, Japan, Malta, Monaco, Nepal, Norfolk Islands, Norway, Peru, the Philippines, Portugal, Spain, and Sri Lanka. The Reva is exempt from most European crash test rules, because its low weight and power registers it in the European heavy quadricycle category instead of the car category. In 2005, Reva showcased the Reva NXG, a two-seater roadster concept car with a nominal range of 200 km miles per charge and a top speed of 120 km per hour, 75 miles per hour. <laughs> 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 
Topic: <laughs> Mahindra E2O. The Mahindra E2O, previously Riva NXR, is an urban electric car hatchback manufactured by the Mahindra Group. The E2O is the Riva G Wiz successor and was developed using REVA's technology. The Riva NXR electric concept car was unveiled at the 2009 Frankfurt Motor Show. Export production was initially scheduled for 2012. Production was initially scheduled for late 2010 with deliveries slated for early 2011. The E2O was launched in India in March 2013 at a price of 596,000 rupees, dollars after a 29% government subsidy granted by the state of Delhi. The E2O was also launched in Mumbai, Bangalore, Pune, Ahmedabad, Hyderabad, Chandigarh, and Kochi. Mahindra also launched the vehicle in the UK but later, in May 2017, withdrew from the market. The electric car has a lithium ion battery pack that takes five hours for a full charge, and with a weight of 830 kilograms, 1,830 pounds, delivers a range of 100 kilometers, 62 miles, and a top speed of 90 kilometers per hour, 56 miles per hour. The product was eventually pulled from the market following the launch of its four-door successor. Topic: Future. Prior to the Mahindra acquisition, Riva had partnered with Bannon Automotive to set up an assembly plant in upstate New York to produce the NXR for the U.S. market. Topic: Mahindra Electric and Formula E. Formula E car was showcased by Mahindra Electric, as a part of the Mahindra Group in the 2014 Auto Expo at Delhi. Mahindra Electric team worked closely with the Mahindra Racing, the racing division of Mahindra Group, to get the Formula E cars ready for the inaugural edition of Formula E World Championship which took place at Beijing in September 2014. Mahindra Racing team is the only Indian team to race in inaugural Formula E Championship. Following a successful first ever Formula E race in Beijing, Mahindra Racing explored the possibility of bringing the electrically powered car series to India in the 2016-2017 season. Topic: See also Electric vehicle industry in India.